Welcome to Oregon. I've literally just landed yesterday after traveling for like, I don't know how long, like 20 hours and I'm with Ryan and it's uh, like five in the morning. So we're just gonna hit up Sparks Lake like I did back in June, but still, I think it's gonna be pretty epic. No, you missed it though. Check that out, it's just starting to pop. I kind of want to do the drone footage now, so I get kind of best time to shoot instead of messing around with drones, because I like drones, but I don't like to concentrate fully on it. going out to that point all the way over there I'm gonna get like a 70 to 200 out check out Ryan on that point over there it's so sick so we literally just finished up at Sparks Lake now we're just gonna head back and chill and then I don't know plan the rest of the trip really see what we're gonna get up to man I was about to get in your passenger side I'm so used to UK cars so I was like gonna start driving <laughs> So after this morning we just chilled and now we're heading to Tum Tumala Falls uh, on the world's bumpiest road. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we're heading to here and I'm going to do some video and droning and yeah, see if, well, I'm not sure about photos but... No. You're supposed to park like this. There's 10 spots here. I'm gonna leave a note for this person. So we just got here, but it's ridiculously busy yeah, yeah. and some people have parked, huh? I was leaving a note <laughs> on a bank slip that I'd already filled up. <laughs> oh my god. That's so good. I'm in shame. It happens. <laughs> Just finished up the waterfall, didn't really take any photos, but I think got some pretty sick drone stuff. Uh, so now, gonna head back, chill out till sunset, probably do some editing and stuff. So we're heading out back out again to Elk Lake for sunset shoot. Uh, we're also gonna head to here in the morning. Apparently there's loads of cabins around it. Uh, we can try and kind of like nick one to do kind of fire shots and stuff. Literally the landscape here is crazy. I cannot stop filming on the road. Check out it. Just got to Elk Lake. And the light is so good. Literally no one around, which is also insane. We think. Man, this is looking so awesome. <laughs> picked like the perfect location of all time it is so awesome checks out it is now really popping i think we're just about to lose the light but it's so insane successful day one it's been pretty sick it's weird to think i was just in london about i don't know 36 hours ago so tomorrow we're going to return here and hopefully catch kind of sunrise, morning mist and stuff. For them, it's been a pretty successful day. Day two in Oregon. We are up again at 5.30. And I'm pretty sure you can't see me then because it's pitch black. But we're heading back to Elk Lake, which was the one we shot last night. It's meant to be a lot different in the morning. Uh, hopefully we're gonna get a load of mist. We've also been joined by Alex who we're meeting in about a minute. And he is the one I shot of his dog around back in June. 
So we've just got to Elk Lake and we met Alex and Finn, uh, Finn's the dog, but we couldn't actually film in the car because it was so dark, it's just about getting light enough to film, which is sweet because there's mist and the clouds are looking pretty sick. It's getting pretty awesome. I want to shoot a load and I'll share some photos, but I don't really want to concentrate on like filming and stuff because I just miss things. But check it out. So we're just going to quickly drive over to the other side of the lake where the fog's coming in. Location number two. It's actually not fog, it's just like fires. Trump's gonna take my, my vape pen. <laughs> <laughs> So we're on the road again after this morning and we're heading to Kusa Falls and Blue Lagoon which is meant to be really safe. Say it from again. Blue Pool. Blue Pool. What did I say? Blue Lagoon. Oh, fuck. The, what is it? The coldest pool in... Yep. Freshwater pool. Coldest freshwater pool in the world or something. Or Oregon, I don't know. Either one is cold. But I don't think we're going to shoot sunset tonight. I think we're just going to chill as it's really cloudy and kind of moody. So it's Blue Pool, which is literally just down the road from uh, Cassidy Falls, but it was just so, so busy. So I think we're gonna hit up really early. So the last time me and Ryan were here, we literally just came in for like five minutes to check it out, which is quite a shame, but we went to Proxy Falls instead, which is just down the road, which was even better, but looking forward to shooting this one. What's up? There's massive sunbeams right now. Oh, insane, let's get down. <laughs> oh my God. Wait, hang on, check this out. Look at this. like the perfect light beam. Something cool with this, like what, you wanna blow some clouds out of the fucking moonroof? 